What's up, you guys? Steven here. So I'm mixing some self-leveler to fix the uh, garage floor closet in the garage floor. And um, normally we do this in a bucket with an electric mixer and a paddle bit. But I happen to have one of these. And so I'm kind of excited to see how the steel mixer does that. So they put three or 4.7 quarts of water in here already per manufacturer specification. And uh, let's just see if the steel mixer makes this. Here we go. Put it in there without splashing it. clear. Let's see. Alright, I figured it out. Once you put the water in and then you pour the bag in, turn it back and forth a couple of times and then automatically come over with a flat shovel and don't even fight it. Let's scrape the stuff that's getting caught. Same on this side. Boom. Get that stuff that's getting caught in there because this stuff is sticky. Woo. Yep. Once you do that, you shovel it back and forth for a minute. Done. That's it. Self leveler and a steel mixer. Hmm. I think I'll try de deck mud next time. Towel guys might like this thing. We'll see. Someone said this is like a huge arm workout. I mean, I'm not really putting a lot. Gravity, man. Gravity's your friend on this thing. Squeak. for this.
getting there. The other nice thing I want to show you about the steel mixer is how easy it is to clean. I like to put that on jet. You get the top. Put that all nice, bam. Comes right down nice, boom. Coming on the side. See that stuff's a little caked on there. Make sure you get it off. Got the other side. Black ones that are for sale are recycled plastic. Made in USA, baby. Later.